my Menards blue bonnet. In the Menards unit, I installed a two-piece MTH smoke unit that the seller said was a replacement for smoking tank cars. And there are two stacks on the Menards shell and I used the first one but I had to drill it carefully drill it out and it, it's uh, not very wide of a stack so you have to be careful it has to be big enough to get the flow coming out but you don't want to ruin the shell the other installation was in a Mike's train house non-smoking unit and it had a large stack area with there was no hole at all but I carefully drilled and uh, created the hole for there in both of these units I used a spark plug boot that could withstand some oil and some higher temperatures and I placed that between the shell and the smoke unit the Menards unit was much more difficult to do the wires were not soldered on to the fan. You had to solder to the fan and to the heater. And the, the fan motor was like the size of a needle head. So what I did is I found it best to tin the wires first and then feed them through the hole and then heat just the wire so you get enough heat so the solder to transfer. Otherwise you'll you'll melt the, the motor casing very easily. The aluminum helps dissipate the heat. The brass standoffs help dissipate the heat.